Yes, good morning. How are you? Yeah, I'm doing great. What about you? I'm also great. Thank you for asking. Okay, so since we are meeting first time, so let's our introduction, then we yes. go first. Yeah. Yes. So can I start? Yes, yes, sure. Okay, so I'm Anisha. I'm from Maharashtra. I'm housewife, but uh, I'm learning this language because uh, I want to do something new in my life. So that's why uh, this is about me. Thank you. Okay, so as you know that my name is Suman and I am from Delhi. As far as my qualification concerns, so I have done graduation and apart from that, I have done NTT diploma. Currently, I'm doing master's in English literature and simultaneously, I have also a YouTube channel which name is Learn English with Suman or there I uploaded English conversation video and sometime I upload with my son and uh, I have uh, actually I also teach online on offline. Yeah, if I talk about my hobbies, so nowadays I love to interact with the people. I love to conversations. Yeah. Great. Thank you so much. Yes. Actually, uh, I yesterday I think yesterday or the the day before yesterday I think I don't know really exactly, but uh, I watched your video. So then I thought, let's go and connect man, because you are now, since you are taking classes, you are teaching there online and offline. So I want to know about that, uh, how do how do you manage and uh, what is your that journey? So I want to know about that. So that's why I wanted to connect you. Okay, yesterday you watched on Instagram? No, no, uh, there is a, uh, in YouTube, Actually, your voice is not cracking, so that's why I'm not getting your proper uh, point. Just a second. Now it's okay. Now it's okay. Now. Yes. Yeah, now it's okay. Yeah. Okay. So could you repeat, please? Uh, I actually uh, I watched your video. I think uh, two days back or yesterday. I don't know when exactly, but I watched your one video. So there, uh, I notice uh, you are. Uh, Means you are teaching, you are taking classes online, offline. So that's why I want to know about that. Uh, your experience, how is your experience? So that's why I can't connect to you. So that's why I texted you. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. So you are originally from originally from Maharashtra. Or... Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'm or originally Maharashtra, but uh, last ten years I was staying in Mumbai. So more, that job purpose I visited in uh, Bangalore as well. So I would stay there uh, one year also. Uh, yes, but now I came back my hometown. So that is uh, my native place. Uh, means my hometown is a rural area. There is no any environment, this environment. But that's why I wanted. I want to do something new, something in my life regarding English. So that's why I'm learning this language very eagerly. Yes, that's great. So as you told me. Uh, you are a YouTuber also. So when did you start your YouTube journey? YouTube journey, I started uh, one and a half years completed now, actually. But uh, I'm not putting there more effort. Uh, earlier I was consistent, really consistent, but nowadays not. Because I feel a little bit monotonous. monotonous. And nowadays I don't get more time also to uh, make video. Means if you want to go good way, so and so there you have to consistently you have to put them more effort means their thumbnail and so many things there but i don't get more time but yes i'm uploading a video alternate day otherwise after two days one video uh, otherwise short video so i'm uploading yes i'm uploading but okay that's great so uh, what do you want to be after your uh, fluent english okay uh, after I wanted to actually uh, full, uh, after, but now I have started actually my journey, teaching journey. So I am now I have started. I have come is uh, one institute. So just two uh, two months before I have started, uh, not two months now two months completed. Uh, I have started teaching offline classes. So I am taking uh, offline classes. Yes, yeah. But uh, I am teaching through. I am also learning. So both yeah. thing I am doing. Through. Yeah, when we teach to someone, then we uh, become more responsible and we also uh, do more focus what should we teach next day and 
what should we do for better our students so yes yes yeah so ma'am i want to know about your teaching uh, experience so when when did you start teaching means taking classes offline and off online when did you start yeah sure actually i started my online journey before 3 months but uh, if i talk about my offline so i uh, taught before marriage uh, when i uh, around 17 or 18 plus that time i used to teach in the crutch and uh, i also teach at my home and uh, when after marriage i also start there uh, 2017 i got married in 2015 and i started okay. again my journey teaching 2017 yeah i teach uh, first to fifth standard i teach all subject all subject okay not yeah. only uh, english yeah i teach english also but uh, small kid also primary okay means subject Both. or speaking part speaking english is spoken okay yeah. okay that's great that's it so how is your experience with first day when you started yeah when you told me here you mentioned uh, uh, when you was miss but before married you start, started teaching so definitely you are there at that time teenager so you are experience there at that time different and now you are different because now you are connecting papers also so what is that experience and now experience what is uh, what do you like to say here okay you know uh, when i uh, taught before marriage so at that time just i don't know too much in the proper way how to teach how to guide the how to motivate i at at that time i didn't know uh, compared to now and I, i was not much perfect compared to now but nowadays uh, i recognize the kids what they actually want and i do uh, i teach proper way and uh, yeah <laughs> okay 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 so if there were means uh, if you uh, there were new batch okay if there were new batch so what do you start, teach first day what i teach first day yes how do you start teaching yeah you know uh, if my first day so first of all one by one i would like to conversation with them i would like to know about them what is label them then i uh, uh, then i start if uh, without conversation without uh, taking little bit uh, introduction you know when we take short introduction then we recognize the person what was the label and yes. we can we can say uh, when my student come to me so uh, i ask some uh, basic questions so when he is able to uh, he is able to reply then i got it he is a medium student but when i when he is uh, they are not able to reply then i got it he need to be, uh, he need to start, uh, he need to from basic and like first of all making sentences and uh, there are so many other things yeah okay okay so uh, so actually now i stuck here because i was thinking in my mind uh, i stuck actually so ma'am um, miss you are teaching their english to english or uh, you are translating yeah, english to hindi listen when uh, student are beginner so we need to uh, half hindi or half english yes. when student uh, able to understand everything then i teach only english okay it okay. depend on uh, our student Hmm. Okay. If the uh, talk about the uh, speaking part, the speaking part. So you realize uh, after that, after teaching some method, you if you when you you realize, they realize. Okay, now he is able to speak a little bit. So which is first part you are uh, teaching them? I mean, speaking part. Well, I mean, uh, topic discussion or daily routine. But uh, do, do you ask them? You should speak now. Okay. When they start little little speaking, right? yeah okay so when student are able to speak little bit so at that time uh, i making hindi uh, like uh, uh, imagination story okay then he 
then he do practice in english okay yeah mm -hmm. whatever i taught him uh, i try to uh, live on that criteria then i speak uh, hindi then he is replying in english and after that i would like to play with them role play and sometime i ask different different culture sometime i ask uh, uh, different different uh, like uh, city hmm. okay 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 that's good you know what uh, uh, actually now i am also i also started teaching so yeah. uh, i like to connect those people who people they have a experience teaching experience because if i connect there and if i ask this kind of question so definitely i get there some uh, ideas so that's why i'm connecting those people so okay. that's why thank you so can much uh, can you tell me how do you start uh, when like student as beginner they don't know how to speak so where do you uh, where from you start to teach them actually um, is my place there is no environment but which is first i got uh, some students so they are uh, they are college student so they know very well little english but they are not able to speak they have bunch of uh, vocabulary and uh, yeah then they, they may, means they are able to understand english but they not able to speak and make sentences so i was when i started so first uh, i also um, came i also talk, same like you i make conversation with them and how is uh, how is those level so i seen i have seen first then i realize okay those those are um, no very well little english so then i started uh, immediately um, to tense actually some basic things first means those what is those meaning and how to use these those um, like this and then after that immediately i have started uh, teaching their uh, 12 tense and uh, means uh, how to make that sentences uh, first sentence then first positive sentence then after that negative then how to ask question then how to give, give them answer so after that when i start uh, explain them uh, 12 tense and they able to understand very well and they know now very well uh, that 12 tense then after that i have started uh, Uh, teaching me i uh, said them explain them how to say daily routine yesterday routine tomorrow routine so now they are able to uh, speak uh, little bit they are now able to tell uh, them daily routine and that thing after that i have started uh, teaching them explaining them how to explain means uh, any topic how to discuss uh, with others and i told them okay now you you can talk to each other Uh, everything about your uh, means about your uh, family hobbies and uh, like this uh, i started so now they are but when now this month uh, i got some uh, school student they are 9th standard and 10th standard so they are very naughty actually they know uh, some vocabulary not vocabulary they know word uh, means first uh, uh first form second form third form but they don't know how to use and uh, so that's why first day i what you like teach them so second day if i uh, go in another step so first then third day first step they forgot and they so that's why i little bit is uh, handling a uh, little bit uh, miss critical so yesterday i told them if you do here for uh, miss you know uh, naughty thing so you will be not able to learn uh, very soon so and those parents also told me you don't speak there politely because my uh, my uh, miss i'm little bit politeness person lady i think so i think actually so that's why they my villager they know very well how i am so that's why they told me don't uh, talk to them politeness you do oh, teach them strictly it seems uh, quite also uh, said to me ma'am please uh scold them and ma'am please <laughs> they yes, also yes. feel like that yeah yes, yes. so that's why i'm thinking miss yesterday again uh, i taught them whatever i taught is i taught them before uh, so then yesterday i again but yeah just right now i have started so definitely i will be after a few months i will get ideas there <laughs> yeah yes yes okay And it's I think 20 minutes so it's a really okay. very amazing conversation um, okay yeah time flies while talking <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, yeah i didn't realize when time finished okay then i would like to connect you again after yeah, few months sure. yeah sure okay, okay. bye 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 bye